Hey, what's up? I'm A-Dub from DX Daily Podcast, and check this out. So Megan Thee Stallion sat down with Gail King for an interview on CBS Mornings on Monday, April 25th, which quickly became a social media talking point. As the interview started trending on Twitter, 50 Cent evidently caught wind of the discussion and found one particular topic hard to swallow. On Tuesday, April 26th, the rapper-turned-television mogul shared a clip of the interview with King asking Megan if she had been intimate with Tory Lanez before the July 2020 shooting incident. Lanez has previously alleged he was sleeping with both Megan and her former best friend Kelsey Nicole. According to 50 Cent, she took too long to respond. Did you have an intimate relationship with him? Like sexual? Yeah, yeah. Did you have, <laughs> did you, Megan, <laughs> did you have a sexual relationship with Tory Lanez? Yes, that's my question. Um, I didn't have a sexual relationship with Tory. Now that I don't believe. She had to think about her answer. SMH, all this itch is crazy. There have been several controversial takes on Megan Thee Stallion's interview. Inflammatory music manager WAC100 shared his thoughts on the interview and called Tory Lanez the real victim in the case. Not only did we say you lied, you said you lied. Now I went from saying you stepped on glass to a gunshot to the foot to I didn't want them to kill any of us. I'm crying for Tory Lanez, the real victim. All this needs to stop. No DNA or prints on the gun and she's still going. Guess we gonna call it the little boy that cried wolf. After all, a stallion is a cult at birth, right? Hope that didn't go over your heads. Megan the Stallion had some words for anyone doubting her story. When someone tweeted, crazy how Meg gets to speak on whomever platform or song about the situation, but Tory, he goes to jail being is still an open investigation. Megan posed a logical question in response. So a man can shoot me, chop up horse legs and music videos to taunt me, pay blogs to spread false information from what's happening in court, record studio albums and make diss tracks, but when I talk to Gail King, that's the last straw? F y'all. Tory Lanez and Megan Thee Stallion are expected back in a Los Angeles courtroom on August 17th. So what are your thoughts about Megan Thee Stallion's interview with Gail King? Do you think her story keeps getting switched up? Do you think she's telling the truth? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And subscribe to the DX Daily Podcast on all streaming platforms. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to poppyx.com.